In this laboratory, PTC is showcasing how to build a digital thread of information between engineering and manufacturing to support closed loop quality and process improvement. Our manufacturing story starts with CAD data created in Creo, PTC's CAD software. This CAD model serves as the foundation for the digital product definition that will continue through the product's lifecycle. This single source of truth, the data stored directly in 3D CAD models, lets us continuously keep products up to date while supporting concurrent manufacturing in the design process and streamlining the production of our longboards. Here in Windchill, PTC's PLM software, we see the longboard product structure. This is an overloaded bill of materials that contains all the available combinations of the longboard subassemblies, from the type of truck to the style of the handlebar. It also specifies the rules for how different variants of these components can be selected to assemble a functional longboard. Here, we can filter for the specific groupings of subassembly variants that correspond to a manufacturable longboard based on options and variants we've already defined. This longboard, for example, consists of a bent handlebar variant and a normal truck variant. But if we want to build a more traditional skateboard, we can filter for one with the relevant variants, high performance wheels, and no handlebar. When we select various components, the visualization on the right is dynamically updated. In the background, we've already established rules that prevent us from selecting combinations of variants that aren't manufacturable. For example, if we choose the street deck or any other longboard without a hole for handlebars, the system won't let us select any handlebar variants because there's nowhere in the deck to install them. Here, we filter to a longboard with black wheels. Now, we'll create the instructions to manufacture it. The first step is to transform the engineering bill of materials into a manufacturing bomb so our team can assemble the longboard. Windchill's bomb transformer lets us manage and compare two independent but related bills of material. This is where a manufacturing engineer plans and tests the design before rolling out changes to the manufacturing line, allowing them to choose exactly when to push changes to manufacturing. Here, the clock symbols clearly show us the parts that differ between the two bombs. After we push the changes from the engineering bomb to the manufacturing bomb, we generate a process plan for each workstation on the line. Here, we can see the process plan used to assemble the front truck. To further explain each step in the process plan, we can add text descriptions, images, videos, and more. As we assign the parts to the steps in the process plan, they will disappear from the manufacturing bomb in the leftmost panel and appear in the visualization on the right so engineers can see visual validation of their progress. Expanding the tree on the left, we see other resources, like jigs and equipment, that are required for this process plan. We can also create resources for tools, workstations, plants, and more. In the process plan, we can also define information specific to the type of equipment and labor at each plant where the product will be assembled. Process plans allow for visualizations to be created for each step, including static images or animations illustrating each step. Opening Creo, we see an animation created in Creo Illustrate that shows how to place the wheels onto the truck. Operators will see this animation in Connected Work Cell, an application that guides them step-by-step -step through the manufacturing process in the context of their specific workstation, including all necessary fixtures and tools. Once we finalize the process plans, Windchill can automatically generate digital work instructions, separating the animation into discrete screenshots if the instructions need to be printed. ThingWorks can take this one step further, pulling information like real-time production data from other groups and tools to provide a more holistic view of data for other users. Windchill is an essential start to the manufacturing process, giving us the tools to organize our CAD data, create rich visual process plans, and automatically generate work instructions so we can confidently streamline production.